Hello everyone and welcome back to the Escapist 2. Today guys, we're gonna move on to a new prison and uh, it's gonna be kind of interesting. It's called Cougar Creek Railroad and uh, the info is you and the vultures overhead know what fate awaits once this train reaches the end of the line. If you plan to see another sunrise, you better disembark by whatever means necessary. So this prison is kind of like a one shot thing. It's not get up in the morning and do your thing and go to bed. It's get up and escape before you get to a place where I guess you're gonna die or something. You and the vultures overhead, no. So it sounds like they're gonna kill you and then your body's gonna be eaten by vultures. Who knows? I'm not gonna let that happen, cause I'm gonna win. So the interesting thing about this prison, guys, is I believe there's only one inmate. I think it's just you and then everyone else is a guard because I tried this yesterday for a little bit. Uh, you know, I was in the in the game for like a few minutes, but my mouse wasn't working right, so I had to wait to re-record it. Anyway, look, uh, all these people are wearing the same thing. They're wearing their hats and stuff, and you don't wear a hat and stuff. So yeah, there's just eight guards, and you have to like sneak around on the train and not get caught. Because if you even get caught outside of your cell, they, uh, they beat the crap out of you. Uh, I don't know why they don't just lock you in, but, you know, I guess then you couldn't escape at all. Let's go. All right. Obviously, I'm gonna be Borf, okay? Don't even ask me those questions. So here it is. We've got a big old train. There's a horse over there. There's, uh, there's a guard with a little baton. There's some, uh, some cells. Cool stuff. Some more cells. I'm not really sure which these ones, what these ones are for. Uh, more beds over here. A little security guard area. Another security guard area. Um, four medical beds and a bunch of other stuff and then eventually you get to the front of the train right yeah what is this supposed to be right here is it like a church or something looks like pews oh no it must be just places to sit down I guess I don't know Ooh, we got fancy little rooms over here huh and then the front where there's coal and there's some dudes and I guess they're shoveling coal or something if we spot you outside your cell, you'll be dealt with, with by force. We will attack you on sight if we see you. Have a pleasant trip. So, yeah, you're just supposed to stay in here, guys, okay? Hey, here's the crazy thing. There's a little time limit over here. Okay, so you got, you got to get out. The time is going down. You can watch it go down. Or, of course, you could actually try and, you know, get out. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and escape. All right? Here we go. Hey, get out of bed, dude. There we go. All right, so if you look right here, which is kind of weird, but I mean, it's a thing, they give you escape tips. They're just written on the wall. This one's a multiplayer tip, so it doesn't matter because I'm playing in single player. But now that, that person has walked away, I'm going to go to the next one. What you got for me? My little phony. I once spent some time with Crazy Joe, a notorious inmate around these parts who wildly suggested that horses could be duped easily using the right means. When I asked for more information, they just muttered under their breath something about fake carrots over and over again. But that's Crazy Joe for you. Okay, um, this counts as a cell, right? I'm, I'm not in the right one, but that's totally cool. You're walking out there, and I'm gonna run over here, and I'm gonna read this one! Hooked on you! Daft Bobby had an even dafter idea that with the right tools he could craft a grappling hook, get up on the carriage roof, and snag a passing gantry to get off this thing. Whoa, are you coming in here? They didn't see me. Okay, cool. Rumor has it that the crazy fool pulled it off, but I don't know. Seems a bit far-fetched to me. It seems like it would be easiest to just make a fake carrot, guys. Uh, so I'm just gonna look around, try and get some stuff. Okay, there's no one in here. So that'd be a nice place to look around. Oh, there is a desk. There is a desk over here. What's in the desk? Okay. So we have a cup, and we have an iron bar, and we have a circuit board. That, that could come in handy. Perhaps we can use the iron bar to make this fake carrot, or whatever. You know, just, just spray painted orange, that's good enough. Uh, uh-huh, you're giving me tips. I don't want your tips. Okay, there's a guy in there. I don't know what he's gonna do next. So we just got chill, okay? He's checking the cabinet. And then he's wa he's walking around. And he's walking away again. And he's leaving, good. Okay, so let's run in here and open this up. Quite frankly, you're all scumbags, even though it's just me. So I think I, uh, I think I understand what you're saying. I think you're calling me a scumbag. Uh, there's a toilet over here. So he won't see me in here. You can flush items. I don't wanna flush any items, get out of here. Stay in here, stay in here, he's not gonna see ya. All right, this is a privacy bathroom. He didn't see me, so that's good. What do you got in here, bro? I don't know what I can actually look in. I can get in here. What's the good of that? I don't need to get in there. Stop, stop it! No, 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 no. Okay, it's fine. I thought he was gonna come back in again. He didn't. So I guess it's just the one box here. So that's good. Oh uh, yeah, good, good horse noise, horse. All right, so let's move back down here, guys, because I'm gonna want to get on the other side of this person and move up through the train. Where are you going? 
How far are you going? All the way over here. All right, well, I'll go ahead and um, go there. Well, I mean, can I sit down here? There's no point in doing that, is there? No, okay, well, they're just gonna beat me off if I do that, so I will just chill inside this dirty, musty old locker thing. Because I just figured it'd be the quickest way to, you know, uh, get to the next area. All right, so in here we have another chair. And then some, whoa, what is that? What's that on the floor over here? It's a thing, I can't get it, so we won't worry about it. All these things are locked. There's nothing on the walls. Very boring. And there's a person over here. Officer Dan TDM. Let me, uh, oh no, don't, don't touch me. Don't touch me, you got your eye on me? Oh, that's not good. Cause, uh, cause I'm in here, okay? So you, you get at, you go ahead and leave. You big, you big idiot. Okay, that worked out pretty well, honestly. I'm gonna wait for him to leave, guys. I don't want him to, I don't want him to spot me leaving this locker. All right, my heat is going down. It'll be okay. He's not going any further to the right. He's coming back again. He's going in there. All right, well, I am gonna go up here because there's like two doors and shit. Can I go in through that door? I can, oh boy. And what can I do? I can sit down. Oh, it's a very nice computer you have here, I guess. Oh, what's in here? Oh, it's a contraband desk! Those are the best kinds of desks, guys. There's nothing in it. Okay, well, forget it then. Screw screw that crap. Um, I'm gonna go to the next place, for sure. I don't see anyone around, you know? Medic desk! Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. What's this? We got a med kit and an adrenaline shot. Pretty sure that's a Slurpee or something. It's not, it doesn't look like a shot at all. <laughs> Just looks like a drink. All right, um, let's go to the crafting, okay? That's what we need to do. Because we need to see, what can I make here? Well, a pretend carrot involves the, what, what is that? A handkerchief, which I have, and um, two pens. So the grappling head is here. I have the two crowbars. I just need, um, you know, I need some duct tape. What else do I need for a grappling hook? Some rope, I think? Well, it must be up here somewhere, right? Grappling hook. Yeah, so you need rope and you need the grappling head. I don't have any of those things. All right. Okay, let's just keep going, you know? Uh, do you, you ladies don't mind me being in here, right? What's your name? Medic whom? Whom? Whom. <laughs> That's a bad name. And this, medic whom as well? What? Medic? What's a medic? Is it is it not called a whom? Is it called a whom? What is a medic whom? I have never heard of that in my life. Couldn't be bothered to begin CPR. What a medic you are. All right, this guy's over here. I just need some pens. Is it that hard to get a pen? Yeah, I can get a dead rat. Oh, shit, get it, get out of here. Yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm leaving. I'm leaving, going really far away. Okay, because I don't want, I don't want Officer Jack Septicot to hurt me. We used to be friends, Jack, what happened? Huh? You turned into a jerk, you jerk. You don't have any pens, do you, Jack? Because that'd be like super good for me if you did, because I need some. I don't think you can pick up any of that stuff over here. Well, this is good so far. This is pretty easy, I gotta say. Oh, that guy. What are you gonna do, that guy? Hey, no way, there's no doors there. That makes it, that makes it difficult. Come on, come on, come on. Run, 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 run. Shit, this is a room that I can't get out of. Excuse me, I need to open up this desk. Oh, you're hurting me. Oh, that hurts. Oh, don't do that, don't do that again. Here comes the medic. It's fine. Free time, according to that over there. So that's, that's good. It's all free time. How far away are you taking me? Why not put me in the hospital bed? Why do you need to do this? You, you're bringing me so far away. You are literally destroying my chances of survival here, woman. Whom? Whoman? What? Who are you? They took away all my shit. I'm gonna restart the prison. Okay, here we go again. Will it be the same this time? Are things gonna be different? I don't have to read anything, which is nice. I just gotta run back here and grab some stuff. So you can actually just hit escape here, guys, but of course, I need to craft a pretend carrot to lure that horse. So. Really, all I'm doing is looking for two pins, and then I can escape the prison. How hard is it to find two pins, though? It seems like it might not be easy at all. Ooh, green pen! I like that! And I'll take the rest of it, too. So the pretend carrot is literally just a handkerchief colored with two pins. That's, uh, that's cool. I mean, horses, horses aren't that smart, are they? They can't figure that out. You didn't even give me a desk, did you? Wow, okay, um, that sucks, because I was hoping to pop some things in there, but I guess I'll just drop them wherever. I mean, I don't need all this crap, you know. Uh, I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind keeping my pen, keeping my pen over here, because if they take that away, well, that's probably not even contraband, is it? Don't scratch your head, bro. Pick that up. Yeah, that's not contraband, so they won't even take that away from me, so that's, 
That's good. Oh, he wasn't scratching his head, guys. It was uh, the power-up attack. It just looks like he's scratching his head. That's all. All right. Well, let me uh, let me get in here before this guy. No way, dude! You didn't see me. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Run. Okay, we're good. We're good. I can't believe that worked. I was very scared that was not going to work. Okay. You want this broom? You can have it. You can have the mop too, dude. I'm not really a moppy broomy kind of guy. All right. Uh, let's just keep on going here. No need to. No need to slow down now. Things are starting to heat up. I'm gonna get past you this time, buddy. And I'm not gonna let that guy see me through the open door. All right, I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot. Run! Okay, uh, oh shit, he's coming this way. Whew. I'm gonna hide here. I don't know how I'm gonna get this up out of the desk. I'm, I'm gonna have a really bad time doing that. Dude, you're not coming this way, are you? Oh, dude. Whoo. Whoo, boy. That was a close one, wasn't it? All right, guys, I got myself an orange pen out of that desk, so now I have an orange pen and a green pen. Holy crap, all I need is a handkerchief, and I'm getting out of this prison. Wow. All right, uh, what's this? Oh, well, look at that. I'm on top, so this is where you can use the grappling hook if you have one, which I don't. And by the way, um, when you complete prisons and do certain achievements, like if I get the uh, My Little Phony achievement and then I get the whatever achievement, each one gives me a key. And then you can use the keys to unlock new prisons. There it is, guys. Got the handkerchief. It's done. You know, this prison is over. So now all I gotta do is I just gotta go up here and craft that. Okay? And now I just gotta get back to where I was and I'll win. If that's the case, I'll probably try and win another way as well. I could probably just run away from these guys and stick this in my desk, couldn't I? Alright, let's see where Jack goes. Very important. Don't want him to don't want him to catch me. Hello, ladies. How are you do wait. Medic poorly. And medic whom so now so now they got different names well that's interesting I thought everyone was just named medic whom don't even don't even think about chasing me okay there's tricks up my sleeves like you wouldn't believe I might as well just go no no I'm getting in here can't even uh, don't even know where I went do you huh what's that all about what's it what's it all about when people just they seem to just lose track of you so easily now, if this is any other game, like let's say Outlast, because Outlast is a game where you can hide in lockers. They will just rip you out of the locker, and they will beat the living shit out of you. Until that living shit is dead. But in this game, eh, who cares, right? I have a bit of a heat on me right now, but I'm sure it'll be no big deal. Oh, gotta stay away from that door. Go away! Okay, let's go ahead and equip this. I've got my carrot, and I guess I just need to use it now? Hey, buddy. Here I come. Horsey, I got a fake carrot. Come here and get that fake carrot, lol. Why are they making the horse run next to it anyway? This doesn't even make any sense. That's it. Yeehaw! <laughs> How do you make a horse stop? Doesn't matter, man. Anyone? Just let the horse run, you know? The horse will just run until it gets tired of running. Then you get off. I escaped. Look at that. I got a, a thing right here. A D? What do you mean a D? Well, how do I get better than a D? Do I just do it quicker? This is, I'm not speed running this. You can't make me. Okay. What a prison. Uh, what a prison that was. I mean, that was cool. And that was an interesting little thing. It was just super easy, you know? Not everything needs to be super difficult, though. I mean, the first prison was quite simple, except I screwed it up a bunch. So let's go back in again, guys, because I just want to... I want to give this uh, grappling hook a try. It sounds pretty cool, and I don't know how it's going to work. But, I mean, geez, that took me no time. So let's try something else instead. I'll leave the same people in there. Jacksepticeye will still be the guy walking around in that uh, little compartment. So that's cool. And let's go. Okay, so what do we need? Well, for one, we need rope. That one is um, uncraftable by the look of it. So I'm going to need to find some rope. Yeah. And as for the grappling hook, I have 70 intelligence. They give you that when you start. You're just you're a smart guy when you go to this prison, okay? Uh, so the grappling hook is just two of those crowbars and duct tape. So I need two crowbars, duct tape, and rope. Everything else don't matter. And then we just need to hop onto a, a whatever the hell they said it was that I got to grapple onto. Okay, there's one. And there's a sock mace here too. I'm not going to try beating anybody up because I feel like it's not going to work very well. All right, here comes number two. We just got to let this guy leave. Get, get out of here, you. Thank you. What do we got? We got a crowbar and duct tape, really? Oh, shit, he's, is he coming back? Is he coming back? No, he's not. Okay, guys. Uh, wow. Wow, would you look at that? 
Would you would you look at that? Got it. Boom. All right then. So now we just got to find ourselves some rope and we're out of here again. Yeehaw! Except there's not going to be a horse this time, so it's not going to be as cool. Then again, I could kind of feel like Spider-Man or the guy from Just Cause or something. Got the hang of this now, guys. Ain't no stopping me now. Um, yeah, I'll go around. Uh-huh. Oh, that was close. That was close. I don't know if that guy would have saw me or not if I was standing there, but I got away. And now I don't get nothing. Screw that. Hey, you guys are gonna have the same shit in your desk? You got you're just gonna have nothing? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, great. Um, what are your names this time? That's important. Bronson and Carlton. They went from whom and poorly to Bronson and Carlton. God. All right, let's check this desk. You got any rope, Jack Septicai? Eh? Nah. Maybe this next guy's got rope. It's gonna be scary though because he's coming, and I'm looking. No rope. Okay, we got to get out of there. Got to get out of there and go back in here. Because I don't know how far this guy comes out. Okay, he went in the other place, so I'm going to go around. We're moving on through that train. The rope is here somewhere. I'm assuming that's how it's, you know, kind of designed. So that you will eventually find some rope in here. I could be wrong. Okay, we got a handkerchief and we got an orange pen. Wow. Oh, shit, that guy saw me. But I'm on top. I'm on the roof. You can't get me because I'm on... Oh, no, here he comes! Oh, help me! Help me! I need... Oh, crap. I need help immediately. I need a... Ooh, a locker. Could I got in the locker? Oh, I did it! I'll get him eventually. Oh, no. You're a smart one, aren't ya? Well, guess what? When my heat goes down, that's it. I'm... I'll... Go ahead and come for me if you want. Oh, they're leaving. <laughs> Wait, what? Medic? Don't call the medic. No, I don't... I'm scared of them. All right, we gotta run over here. They're gonna stand up and they're gonna look that way like a bunch of idiots. They're just one idiot because it's one person. But let me just hold, hold. I need another player. Why well, got another player? Damn it. Okay, it's fine. Just need some rope. Just need some rope, guys. It's gonna happen. Rope. I got rope. Okay. 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 Don't come in here. Don't come in here. I'm making a thing. Okay. I'm shy. He leaving. I going. Okay. That's it, guys. It's all over now. Even this uh, this idiot over here. Who is that idiot? Hey, who are you, idiot? It uh, doesn't matter who you are. doesn't matter who you are. Oh, God, they saw me. What do I do? Oh, shit. Oh, God. Escape. I could attach to a passing gantry. Yeah, I know you could. Oh, I didn't, I, I didn't equip it. I didn't equip the, the thing. Shit. Ugh, don't hurt me again. Don't. Oh. 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 Okay, they left. Seriously, they 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 do not screw around. Okay, in in like the the, the good way. Uh, so we just need to go ahead and put that on the first one and go. Hey Gantry, get o get over here, Gantry. I need you. That's what a Gantry is, eh? Oh, that's good to know. Look at Officer Idiot down here, just walking around. No big deal. Now where am I? Err. Uh, now he's scratching his head. There it was. There it was. Crafted two items, guys. This is a better escape this time. C? Give me a C. You gave me a D again. Stop giving me the D. Alright. Well, that, uh, that was two ways to escape that prison, guys. Alright, that was a double episode. Woo! <laughs> Let's go to the criminal record, okay? I want to take a look here. So there's two more things. There's do the locomotive and loose caboose. So I'm not really sure how you get the fourth key in this one, guys, but um, the third key obviously has something to do with having a second person and holding open a door. I think it was like a red button in there as well, so you probably got to hit that. And then you get, I think, the loose caboose key. So do the locomotive. I don't know. Probably involves getting further up the train, though. Anyway, guys, so that is the Cougar Creek Railroad Prison in The Escapist 2. Leave a like if you want to see some more prisons. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.